Hello everyone, welcome to our studio today. I'm glad you joined us. I hope you're painting with us, but if you're not, I'll just sit back and relax and enjoy. Now, what I'm going to do, let me grab this little brush right here. I'm going to go ahead and sketch a little road here. And in order to do that, I can use burn number or raw sign, uh, a little of both. And I like that highlight there, and we probably put a highlight all along here. We'll start back here. I'm not sure how we'll do it, but let's do it something similar to this. Okay, that's just a rough idea. Now, what I was thinking about earlier is, is building a little barn here, and probably what I should do is at least at least outline it right now, okay? So, where do you want it, here or here? Let's put it right here. You want to? I don't know. It don't really matter. I'm going to actually, what I want to do is color it, but I'm going to take a little Payne's gray, take a little of this blue, a little of the green, a little more of the light blue. I want to be able to see it, and I probably, let's see if I can see that. I might have more room over here. Now let's put something else over there. I'm going to grab a small little brush, go into that color. I probably can sketch it with a brush. I'm going to leave a, I'm going to put the front of it right along in there. I'm going to go back this way with it. I don't know if I should put the edge of it right on the side of the road or not. Now if you notice these lines, this is shorter than this area. That's perspective. That's how you make something look. Pretty real. I may change that road because I don't want him right against my building here. Is that big enough? I think so. I'm going to straighten that up just a little more because I, I changed the angle. And if you follow these two lines all the way back, they would meet somewhere over here, and these would too. I like that pretty good. I'm going to change that road because I don't like that. This is another 
section of that bar. Now this bar is going to have a angle roof on it. Now I'm taking my time drawing this. Now let's do the top of it. You want to? What color would you make that? Blue. What do you think? Okay, this side will be darker than this side, so I'll lighten this side up considerable. Now let's grab a little of that light, real light blue. Looks white, doesn't it? That's okay. I like that. Now we're doing all of this freehand. I want to add a little bit of angle to that roof. Now I'm going to make this lighter on this side. I want that dark right there. Oh well, we just about built our little barn. Don't look too bad, does it? Okay, now what I need to do is put a door in it. Then we'll grab a little green. A little blue, a little paint gray. See if that'll do it. That won't do it. I'm gonna rinse my brush out. Make it easy. We'll just use paint gray. I think I want a big door in front of it. About like that. I 
And I want a window probably in this one. And I want a high loft. And probably some windows in the side of it. Let me grab a little more of my black. Way over there, isn't it? Now you can put a lot of detail in this, or you don't have to. Now I like the bottom there, and I'm going to add a little bit of a little bit of green in that. Where is my green? There it is. I want a shadow across there. Maybe I can get it with this color. Not dark enough, is it? Maybe it is. I'm gonna get all black. It's not black, it's paint's gray. <laughs> That yeah, looks a little better. And now back in there, we'll probably add some light color. Time flies when you're having fun, you know. I want to add something back in there. We'll change that color probably to some of this. I want my Maybe that. What do you think? Wow, we got a barn. We need to put some trees or something back here. Maybe some sticking up over the top, what do you think?
sort of like that. All right, and we put a lot of that stuff in different spots. Let me clean that brush out. As of right now, we've got plenty of time. Now I'm going to go back to my uh, fan brush. I'm going to start adding some detail in here and put some grease and stuff around this little uh, barn. And probably later on, we'll add a little more detail to it. But as of right now, not too bad. I'm going right on the edge. I may keep this dark. I'm not not sure yet. Okay, let me grab my knife. I'm going to grab a little green. And that's sap green there. That makes it a little darker. I'm going to start with that. And get a little bit right on the edge of it. Now over here, All right. Now I'm just getting that right on the edge of the fan brush. I'm going to go in here with a little bit right here. I'm going right up to the edge of the road and we'll put some shadows and different things in there a little bit later on.
Now the advantage of having that dark down here, you could almost just do what I'm doing and say that's totally finished because it gives you enough shadow in there. And you can do this with a one inch brush. It adds a little different detail in it. And you can come in with this one and pull some of these up. Make little grassy looking areas. I'm going to go ahead and finish this side. or I'll, Well, I say finish. I'll go ahead and put this color on. This probably will not be the finish. If you notice, I've got different planes. This is one section, that's another section, which may be a little different. Now, that side you could say it's finished, it's probably not, but we will come back and do some extra stuff in there. Now I'm going to lay that down right there because I need a smaller one. Little more I may make that a little bit um I actually started putting <laughs> a waterfall over, but I guess that's a road, isn't it? I want to lighten it up a little more and then probably come back with some as the darkness is already there so I want to lighten it a little bit more let me mix up a little more color yellow orange A little more yellow, at least in one section of it. And that's the lightest color. Beautiful. Now I'm going to grab a little of my brown here. Where can I put it? Right there.
It's a long reach over there, isn't it? That's okay. Beautiful. Got about a minute or two. Got a little light color there. That will change a lot. All right. We're going to have to leave you, it looks like. But we'll be back. I probably will. Make these a bunch of rocks and a lot of rocks along the road, probably. Anyhow. Wrench that out, and I'm going to say we'll be back next week, okay? <laughs> Goodbye and God bless.